Um, so many people are looking for a different option that they just feel like they connect more with, and I feel like that's the Alberta party. A familiar name is out door knocking during this provincial election, but not for the party you'd think. She's Montana Getty, granddaughter of the late Alberta Premier Don Getty, and she's working for the Alberta Party's Catherine O'Neill. I did vote Conservative when I was younger, and I just believe that my views changed as I got older. Despite her evolving views, Getty says she still shares some of the political ideals her grandfather did, and despite the relation to one of Alberta's most well-loved premiers, she doesn't feel any pressure having a recognizable last name. Um, I have it tattooed on me. It's pretty, it's pretty, pretty important to me to be a Getty. His legacy lives on, and it's going to forever, but sometimes people just don't share the same views. He did, he had tons of the same views as I do, um, social public service and everything, and he just, I, th I think that he would actually be happy with me making this decision. She adds that while campaigning for Catherine O'Neill and the Alberta Party, people have shared a lot of memories of her grandfather, whether it was his time as Premier or playing quarterback for the Edmonton Eskimos. It's always so, like, amazing to talk about him with people because they have so many great stories and it's always such a positive reaction. Getty explains part of the reason she chose to campaign for O'Neill in the Alberta party is because of the seemingly constant negativity and accusation hurling between the NDP and UCP, something she says her grandfather was opposed to. My grandfather would be very disappointed with how everything looks right now. Um, he was a very strong man, very positive man, and he did not enjoy negativity. In Edmonton, Darcy Ropchan, City News.